Hello everyone, this is Jubair Mahamud, a data driven digital marketing expert. In this video, you will know about how to add Google Tag Manager with your big commerce website. This video will be very informative for you. So, without any further delay, let's get started. So, big commerce is very popular CMS as like Shopify. It has different kind of benefit and some web analytics expert have the issue how to add the Google Tag Manager with big commerce website. So for this reason, I have created this video. So as you see, this website has Google Tag Manager. I have added this Google Tag Manager and this too is for another reason. And I will remove this Google Tag Manager and I will add this again. So let's get started. So at first uh, we have to came the back end. Okay. We are came into the back end of the we have came into the back end of big commerce website. You will get the access from the client and then you can follow this step. From the big commerce admin panel, you have to go the store font. Okay. Then store font, you have to click the store font. Then here you see the script manager option. Click the script manager option. Here you can see the uh, Google Tag Manager code. I have added this. I will delete it. Okay, I have deleted it and now the Google Tag Manager was successfully removed. There are no Google Tag Manager. So how can we edit it? Here you see the option create a script. Click it. Okay. And this name of the script it is required. Okay. So we'll keep the name is Google Tag Manager it approach okay giving it to a name description is not mandatory then location on the page where the script was uh, loaded okay so we will keep it head head okay select the page where the script will be added and here here you will select the all the page google tag manager should load the all the page in your website that's why uh, that's how it can track well then another thing is here is script category you will click it analytics you have to select this option analytics okay then script type uh, script type is script okay it is not a url okay so we will go to our google tag manager and click the gtm code okay here you see the google tag manager code head code uh, we will copy it and paste it here okay remember this id gtm n n7 lv rct okay we will save it our script is created now we load the website with tag assistant okay here you see the gtm n7 lv rct this is my practice gtm so this is successfully added with my big commerce website this is how you can add gtm in your big commerce website now the reason of how i added the another script because of because of enabling the data layer data layer as you know the data layer is very important to know about product product id product order value currency there are more more options uh, in the data layer so for enabling the data layer you have to buy a plugin called tag rocket this this is 30 days free or uh, monthly 20 dollar per month and costly around annually 20 dollar into 12 okay 264 dollar annually is fee but i have enabled it uh, with my code and i have enabled it with my service you will get data layer for annually free so this is you see when a purchase happen there are some event is coming uh, you haven't paid this tag rocket $264 uh, yearly. So with my service, you will get this uh, data layer enabled free. So if you interested, you can you can go into description. There are my website. You can book a meeting and I will I will help to enable the data layer uh, with my service cost. Hopefully this video will be very helpful for you. If you are interested to know more things about web analytics, digital marketing, so considering subscribe my channel. So this channel will be very helpful for you. So till that, take care, goodbye and tata. Thank you.